Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to Fall Guys. Hope you guys are doing good today. Uh, we're on to Seesaw. Let's get it on, dude. We got a uh, season two coming, like creeping up like real fast. It's like, as far as I know, six to seven days off at this point. It's exciting, dude. Bunch of new game modes gonna be coming in. It's, uh, it's kind of popping, right? It's gonna be weird, man. Uh, feel like the game is gonna get another injection of hype. But you know, the game, uh, the game's still pretty hype if you ask me, dude. Like, I mean, you can still get a game within like one minute, any time of day that you decide to play. And uh, we're talking like 60 man lobbies. Like there's a lot of people at the end of the day. But definitely excited to experience a bunch of new game modes. That's for sure. Um, it's just, I don't know, dude. It's gonna be fun to relearn because I think one of the most fun parts about Fall Guys is like, you know, you're on a new game mode and you're like, oh, okay. Uh, so what is the best way that I do this? You know, it's like a fun party game, but like, what is the best way to tackle this new obstacle course that is ahead of me? And I think that's why like all of the small little additions they've added to the maps along the way, like they did like two weeks ago or something has made the game like really fun to play. Cause like every time you play a map, you're like, oh, you're re-strategizing. You're like, oh, dude, this hammer's here. So, you know, maybe I shouldn't take that. You know, it's probably a bad idea. And then the risk element is like, dude, maybe I should take that. Cause maybe it's uh, and maybe it's a good idea. Uh, Team Tail Tech. I'm in a pretty calm mood today. Not like in a big grabby mood, you know, not in the mood for ruining people's days. You can see how cute I look today, dude. I got this new little uh, tail. It's, uh, yeah, check out my butt. It's a cute little butt, if I do say so. I don't know how I still have this tail, dude. I just went past like five people. Apparently going against the grain, nobody expects you to have a tail because you're like, why are you running through us all? What are you doing? Surely you don't have a tail if you're just jumping over a pack of like, so many dudes, right? Like, surely not. But yeah, you can't see it that well here, but uh, I got this cute little white duck butt with these cute little feet. You can see my feet, they're cute. I'm wearing the hearts right now, which is uh, also kind of, I mean, it's, the whole thing's just kind of like cuteness overload, you know? I'm looking good today. And my outfit represents my mood. I'm in a cute, calm mood. I'm here to play the game. You know, respect all of my opponents and just try and get myself to the finale. Have a good time along the way. Try not to get grabbed. Nobody else ever goes on the slime. What if I just stand on the slime? Nobody's ever stood on the slime before, dude. This guy wants it. Oh, he got it. <laughs> okay, wait, I want it back, bro. We can get one of these. There we go. Thank you. Ooh, my head. We're going to go up here. Uh, Into the hammer looks good. We'll leave though, qualified, easy peasy. I have a good time on team tail tag, but not like real tail tag. I think cause like, you just have more horses in the race, right? It's like, you know, solo tail tag. You can hold the tail for one minute and 29 seconds the entire time, then you lose it in the last seconds. Now, if you do that in team tail tag, like your chances of everybody having it at the end is just higher. Because, like, you're only going to lose so many tails at the last second. Ooh, a slime climb, dude. That's what I like to see. Makes me happy, dude. I think slime climb is the best game mode for a myriad of reasons. One, the fact that there's, like, a timer on it where it kills you if it catches you up just adds, adds a sense of urgency. Two, the difficulty level is probably the highest out of, like, almost any race in Fall Guys. Um, the speed run potential due to all of the shortcuts. But then the, the icing on the cake is that it also has the highest potential for grabbing other people and taking them off the map. Which is a good thing. You know, this game would honestly be boring if nobody could grab each other, dude. Is, you know, as evil as that sounds, that's what makes it fun. The fact that you're against... I'm stuck. Okay, that's not ideal. The fact that you're against so many other people, and you never know what each little bean is going to do. Like, are we going to get a bean on this pipe harassing us, not letting us cross? Yeah, we are. I'm not going to let it happen. I'm out of here. 
It is so tempting to go push him off. It is so tempting to get this guy. Because he deserves it. The slime's coming. If we attack him at the right time, there could be something going on here. See, this red star guy, he's got the same idea as well, dude. He's got the same idea. All right, let's, let's see if we can go get him. And, oh, 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 it's on now, dude. Okay, okay, okay. We got to get moving. We got to get moving. I don't actually remember what the guy looked like. Whoops. I was too focused. Guys, come on. We're in, we got a sense of urgency. Is the guy out? I don't, I don't remember what he looked like, but I don't see anyone that looks familiar. Oh, it's that guy there, the little eggy looking guy with the wife beater on. We gotta go kind of fast here though. He's off the map, dude. You love to see it. Okay, we're taking it slow. Oh, you, what are you doing, ducky? Okay, we gotta move, we gotta move, dude. Time is uh, catching up to us here. It's all gonna be worth it if we end and that little guy who was mean to everyone doesn't end. And look at that, it's all worth it in the end, dude. Karma wins. Good, guys. Finish first. Well, seventh in this case, but, uh, you know, good enough. Ten remain. Nine. Dude, that's gonna throw us straight into a finale. I gotta say, dude, I've been playing this game on stream, and I'm getting destroyed. Every time I come and play for YouTube, I'm just getting finale after finale. So, you know what? Thank you for blessing me, YouTube. Appreciate it, yo. Hexagon. All right, I'm really dialing in, dude. I wouldn't mind a, a little win here. Get the streak going. Let's see what we can do. There I am. You can see my cute little uh, duck butt. Let's see here. Hexagon is the, the biggest brain game out of all the games. There's a lot of, like, very, very quick decision-making that you have to make. Like, how are we going to deal with this guy with the diving bell on his head? Well, we're not. He's got less hexes than me. The competition is on the other side. We're going to run these ones out and then fall three layers like an idiot and then fall another layer. Now we're in trouble. <laughs> now we're in trouble. We got to buy as much time as possible here. I'm basically last place at this point. Don't know where anyone is above me. We're going to run this diving bell guy out. That is one thing I can do. That is one decision I will make. Oh, he made the jump. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Wait, wait. We got a self section. Don't even think about it, pineapple. Okay, this is now... <gasps> Why are you running it out, bro? Why are you running it out? Okay, he wanted his own little section. That's okay. Um, I see exactly my pathway here. I might even drop down and take that below section real quick. Yeah, we're going to run it out. That guy wants it. Okay. This is getting hot. I know. Oh, I messed it up. I know there's people above me. Dude, no, please. Okay, we're gonna run this guy out. Uh, it's getting hectic. I'm gonna go over here. Never mind. Change my minds. There's a big area here. Ooh, deep breaths, man. Deep breaths. There's two guys over there. We're gonna try and run these two out real quick. Okay, we're running each other out. This is not ideal. It's just me and him. I don't know how many. Go yes! Oh, baby. What a run! That was a top quality hexagon game right there, dude. The cute little duck butt coming in strong. Let's get this bread. Oh, baby. Very nice. Get that streak up, dude. Let's go. Crown on the head. Get me into the next one. Okay, door dash is not what I want to see on the, uh, the one streak here, dude. Uh, let's see where the final door is. It looks like the, uh, yeah, the one on the left, but on the right from the other side. So at least we know what the final door is. Um, I don't like to see door dash because door dash can come down to a lot of random elements. And uh, when we're on the streak, that scares me. I think Whirly Gig, I think Whirly Gig is probably the best starter race. I feel like, you know, 
Enough people mess it up that, you know, you can come back even if you something goes wrong. So right door, remember, right door. We are in a decent placing so far. We're gonna have to try and open one of these doors though. Are you kidding me, dude? Okay, full left, full left. What a disaster, dude. The right side is in the lead by a significant margin here. Now I do know that I wanna be over to the right for these final doors. So let's go over there. Hopefully this guy, no one's gonna open it, okay. Just keep to the right side. Okay, we're looking good, we're looking good. We're looking bad. We're looking bad. I, I don't seem to be able to get my feet. Dude, move these little duck feet. Come on, man. We're stuck in the crowd. 39. Uh, and we're in, dude. But it was it was closer than it needed to be. <laughs> it's given me all of the scary stuff. Like, all of the stuff you don't want when you finally get your streak going. And, you know, it's not the end of the world. You know, we're on a one streak. It's not like we're on a two win, three win here. Um, but like, this is not what I want to see when I'm looking to keep this streak going. Because this is the kind of stuff where, you know, this, this is a big random element involved. Like, I've got no idea what teammates I'm going to get. We're even on Team Yellow, dude. That's a bad start in of itself. That hammer is looking to be kind of nasty. Now, we got a ball over here. I'm going to help out Mr. Walrus and his friends. Also, Mr. Walrus. And uh, we'll see if we can get these balls moving to our side of the map. Looks like Team Red is going to help us out. Right, everybody's over here, dude. Everybody's over here. Nice. It goes in. Any other balls? Do we want to go to the red side here? It's not looking good. It's not looking good. I'm going to go over to red side. Try and grab a few of these because we got quite the party going on over here. And uh, I think we can get some movement going. There's one of the balls in. There's another one. Another one coming in hot. Me and Mr. Wolfie here. Come on, Mr. Wolfie. Let's go, dude. No, no, no. We want to send it left, left, left. Let's work together here, guys. Work together. I don't want to go out on a team game. We're going out on a team game. Never lose hope. Never lose hope. You never know what's going to happen. Let's keep that ball moving. Apparently, my head sends it backwards. Why am I wearing lube on my head? Nobody under knows or understands, dude. Oh. I mean... Not, it's not looking good. I don't see anything happening on the other side either. Oh, this is bad. We lost. Oh, no, dude. Not the team game, man. All right. Just some breathing room, you know. Change up the skin a bit here, dude. Uh, still looking cute, though. Still feeling kind of cute. Still wiggling my butt through this uh, seesaw course. I know you, you can't take your eyes off my little duck bean butt. Look at it move. Look at that tail. It does not get cuter than that, dude. Oh, am I gonna make it? Let's go for it. Alright, nice. I say I like the feet as well. I might pull this guy off. I don't know. I just kind of want to. Sorry, dude. I don't know. It just, it, something got into me. I don't know what it was. You can't uh, predict everything here, dude. Oh, oh. Yeah, we lifted up. We're gonna work together, okay? Never mind. I'm out of here. This is totally gonna tip. It's gonna tip. No, tip it, tip it, tip it, tip it. Ah, I can't believe that unicorn got through, man. All right, let's get up. This seems to be going pretty well, though. Like, oh, we got a yeet hammer. We're not taking it. I've tried to take the yeet hammer on this map so many times. It's useless. Not for that guy, though. That guy just did great with it. Is he ahead of me, though? He's not ahead of me. He's definitely not ahead of me. Yeah, send ourselves up the left here, and, uh... Mm. There's a little bit of, like... A little bit of evil creeping into me. Like, I wanna... I kinda wanna, but, like, it's not enough yet. Let's, let's just go to the next round. Back to hoarders. Don't put me on Team Yellow again, please. Am I down there? I don't see my cute butt. I don't think we're on Team Yellow. Yes, there we go, dude. Now we win. This is the team I needed last time. My pi Oh, we got a pineapple, though, dude. That's not good. We got two pineapples, in fact. Pineapples are mischievous. Anybody who plays a pineapple... I, I think pineapple is one of the worst, like, culprits for being evil in this game. Like, I know I've said a lot of different things are evil in this game, like I said... Yeah, like, it depends what, like, is in the store at the time, but, like, consistently over time after playing this game. I don't know how many hours I've played now. 
I want to say it's in the 60 plus. I know it's in the 60 plus range, but it might be, you know, getting close to 100 maybe. I'll have to check at some point. And I can tell you without a doubt, almost every single pineapple that you run into is up to no good. Every single time. It's just those kind of people who like to watch the world burn, you know? Like, it's like when somebody likes pineapple on pizza, they like to flaunt it. Just to, like, see your reaction. Just so you're like, ugh, I don't like pineapple on pizza. And they'll be like, oh, it's so good. I love pineapple on pizza. It's delicious. I can't believe you don't like it. Just so they can see you be like, oh, no, it's gross. And just, you know, just tick you off a little bit. It's the same kind of people who are picking the pineapple in game that like pineapple on pizza. I guarantee it. And they're just up to no good, dude. They just want to get a reaction out of you. They want to grab. They want to see you suffer a little bit, you know? See, Team Red easy. Let's go, dude. Qualified. Let's do Jump Club. Easiest game ever, dude. I never lose. Trust me. It's so easy. Look at that. It doesn't get easy on that. You just press the jump button. You see the pineapple? Look at the pineapple grabbing. I told you. He's just going at it, grabbing everyone that he sees. He's going the wrong way. You know, he's literally driving his car the wrong way down a one-way street, pretty much, in this case. He's grabbing people, you know? He's the, you know what the, the pineapple guy kind of guy is, dude? You know, like, you're in a lane, and like, the queue for that lane while you're driving is extremely long. But, like, there's a fast lane next to it that goes straight, but you're, like, turning left into this lane. Everybody's waiting patiently, waiting for their turn to go left. And he just goes right down the middle. And then he just indicates right at the end and just pulls into the queue right at the front. And he's like, oh, dude, sorry, I messed it up. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. You just wanted to get to the front of the queue, Mr. Pineapple. I know what you're up to. Let's see if he went off. Where is he? Yeah, he disconnected. He's out of here, dude. That's what you get, pineapple boy. You're out of here. Now we've only got friendly beans left. I don't see anyone in this lobby that looks scary, you know? The beans with the eggs on are fine. I never see those guys get up to anything. Plain beans with no, like, um, like bodily, att <laughs> bodily attachments on uh, can sometimes be dangerous, but it's, it's hit or miss with them. Like that red guy right there with like the, the cracked pavement pattern. That guy, I don't know about that guy. If there's anyone who's gonna be dangerous in this lobby, it's gonna be him, but uh, overall, this is looking like a pretty reasonable lobby. Sometimes the ninjas can go off, sometimes. But no, I think this is a very friendly lobby. So keep our eye on uh, Cracked Pavement guy. Oh, you see the wolf have a little go there? The wolf's having a go at everyone, dude. Okay. But let's say, that's just innocent, you know? Like, the wolf doesn't know any better. He's grabbing because it's his first time playing, and he's like, oh, this is fun. Look at this. Unless it's a wolf in disguise. Could be a wolf in disguise. You never know. Okay, we're gonna go to the left side here, dodge this one. Yeah, red pavement guy seems to be fine. Again. The plain beans could be anyone. There we go. Wait, didn't I say something about di diving bell beans the other day? I feel like it did. I, I definitely did. Okay, we keep an eye on this guy. I can't remember what I said, dude. That thought process has been buried in... You know, a couple of days of video game knowledge. It needs to be dusted off. We'll see if this guy decides to go for it. But if we get this, if we get this, I feel like... I mean, it depends how many people go out, but, like, we could get pretty close to a finale here, dude. You know, I would love, dude, like an 18-man hexagon. I don't even know how many people we have. Well, I think 14 is the max, so we got 15 people here. I think it's 12 man hexa, dude. 13 man hexa. Look how friendly this lobby is. Oh god. You gotta be kidding me, man! It just. No way! I'm so sad, man. <laughs> I watched my poor little bean just get poked out. Oh no. 
That was so close, dude. So close. Oh, man. Yo. Sometimes it be like that. Oh. oh, well, I hope you get... Oh, it was hexagon as well. All I needed to do was hit one more jump. Guys, I hope you've been enjoying the content recently. Um, Thank you for watching, and I hope you have a good night. Uh, peace, guys. Bye.